In comparison uh, with the bishop's uh, opening, Italian game is much uh, more complex. Uh, there are much more lines uh, to look at. And uh, it begins with the following order of moves. e4, e5, knight f3, knight uh, c6, and now the move uh, bishop uh, c4. Just a uh, common uh, information uh, for you. The ideas and plans in the Italian game are very similar to the Spanish game or Rui Lopez. I have already been explaining a lot of ideas and plans, especially connected with the attack on the Black King in one of my previous DVDs made for chess base, made in attack in the Italian game. So you can uh, find a lot of uh, ideas and supplementary material from another DVD. In this position, after the move uh, bishop c4, black has uh, two main moves. One of them is knight f6, and another is uh, bishop uh, c5. So, as a rule, which you should uh, remember, the the best uh, option uh, for black uh, to develop is to try to play actively in this position. And uh, the better place for the black bishop is the square c5. Usually when the bishop is developed uh, to other places like e7 or g7, white should be able to get an advantage in uh, all uh, lines. So, if bishop c5 is not uh, played, to summarize, uh, white should always be better. Also, in the lines when bishop uh, c5 uh, is uh, played, the most unpleasant uh, lines uh, for white are those when black is playing d7, d5. The most aggressive approach from the black uh, side. If uh, black is uh, playing uh, passively, then again uh, white has all uh, chances to get an advantage and to play for advantage. In the first uh, video clip uh, on the Italian game, we will look uh, at the side lines besides uh, the moves uh, knight f6 and uh, bishop c5. And we will begin with the uh, move uh, d six uh, here. When uh, black is uh, playing uh, passively and not uh, trying to develop his pieces and when he is also not uh, fighting uh, for the center, the best uh, way for white uh, to play by himself uh, would be the fight for uh, the center. And in this position after the move uh, d6 there are several possibilities. One of them is to play d4 immediately. For example, e d4, knight uh, d4, g6, knight c3, bishop g7, bishop e3. And now we have a similar position uh, to the Philidor uh, defense, early exchange on d4. And white here is slightly better. This is my game against uh, Marin in Portomano 2009. You can look at these uh, games in one of the supplementary databases. If you don't want uh, to play d4 immediately, you can uh, prepare this move beginning with the move uh, c3. And then you want to play d4 and fight for uh, the center. So this position is also with advantage for white. And that's uh, why the move uh, d6 uh, is not uh, popular nowadays and almost uh, never played by uh, anybody. Because uh, black must uh, develop and the move uh, d6 uh, does not uh, facilitate the development of uh, the black uh, pieces. Another possibility for black is to play f5, trying to play the Janish gambit like 
in the Spanish game, but only against the Italian game. But in this position, bishop on c4 is standing better than on b5 and uh, making the move like uh, d4 white is able to get huge advantage in this position for example f e4 knight e5 d5 uh, bishop uh, b5 and then quick castle and attack in the center so the position of the black king is weakened and no development huge advantage and if uh, the move uh, d6 is played then white can play knight g5 knight h6 and now d5 knight b8 knight c3 also with advantage for white but of course uh, the chances that you will encounter the moves like uh, d6 and f5 are very very small and maybe one game out of 100 just uh, very important uh, to know couple of moves uh, that you should uh, make uh, after them and then the rest you can find behind the bot another possibility for black is uh, to play g6 after the move g6 you can choose between the standard move uh, c3 and if bishop uh, g7 then uh, d4 with a better position uh, for white or you can even uh, try more aggressive approach connected with the pawn sacrifice for example d4 of course uh, always when you sacrifice uh, the material in the opening after the opening you must be extremely careful because uh, material is important uh, in uh, chess let's look e d4 and now the move c3 so dc3 knight c3 bishop g7 queen b3 queen e7 and now the move like knight d5 queen e4 bishop e2 should give white a big advantage because uh, black king stuck in the center no development and white is ready to castle play rook e1 and uh, play for the decisive attack so the move, uh, third move, uh, g6, is also not uh, good. There is uh, also the move h6, after which, again, it is possible to choose uh, between the move uh, c3, preparing the move uh, d4, or you can play d e4, e d4, knight d4, also with advantage for white. Another side uh, line after the move bishop c4 is uh, the move uh, queen f6 uh, now you just need to play knight c3 and after knight g7 you can play knight b5 attacking the pawn on c7 also with advantage for uh, white after the move uh, bishop c4 there is uh, also the move like knight d4 knight d4 e d4 and in comparison with a similar variation in the Spanish game where the bishop is on b5 and later white plays bishop b5, uh, bishop c4, here white has an extra tempo. And uh, one extra tempo in such positions means that white has huge advantage after the move c3, d3, knight c3, and then followed by uh, d4. Development advantage control of the center guarantees uh, white big advantage another possibility for black is the third move bishop e7 here after the move bishop e7 again white has two possibilities one is to play quietly c3 and then to try to play d4 similar to variations after knight f6 d3 bishop e7 or it is even uh, possible to select the more aggressive uh, way to play d e4 after which uh, black has uh, two possibilities uh, how to react one taking on d4 and another is uh, the move uh, d6 
now knight uh, c3 knight f6 if not knight f6 uh, move uh, bishop g4 and after the move uh, bishop uh, b5 uh, white has an advantage so knight f6 now h3 castle uh, castle and we have uh, the position similar or uh, castle and now we have uh, the position uh, similar to the Philidor uh, defense and white is slightly better here of course it is uh, necessary to know the theory here but with the correct uh, play white should uh, be able to keep the advantage so again as you see after all uh, side lines by black you can uh, play uh, differently or you can uh, play actively in the center making the move d4 immediately or you can play c3 and then prepare the move uh, d4 but what you should uh, remember and memorize uh, very well when the opponent is by himself do not develop uh, quickly do not uh, participate in the play for the center then you must grab the center by yourself so that was uh, everything that we had to know f uh, how to play against uh, the sidelines of the Italian game in the next uh, clip we will start looking at the main continuations.